troops battalion. Three long tours to Iraq and most recently one to Afghanistan. By the end of fiscal year 2015, the Army is projected to cut 33,000 soldiers. This change could affect the future careers of many troops and may cause them to seek civilian employment. 4th Armored Brigade Combat Team, 1st Armored Division, is preparing its troops by calling in the Human Resource Director of El Paso, Linda Ball Thomas, to train 42 Alpha Human Resource Specialists on transitioning into the civilian HR job market. There are jobs in HR all over the world that you can apply for and be in, but you really should get certified. All service members throughout the Army should plan for their future, because although the drawdown does not affect everyone, transition to the civilian world is inevitable. To make sure you have a, a degree of some kind, or actually the certifications before you get out, because you can't get out with the basic 42 Alpha skills thinking, oh, you're going to transition into the civilian sector and it be equal, because it's not. You need some kind of degree or the certifications before you even think about getting out and moving into the HR field. HR Director Ball Thomas urges soldiers to use every resource available to prepare themselves. She also advised soldiers to apply for entry-level positions to get their foot in the door, and then use their military training and leadership to advance their careers. But if I have to start at the bottom, I think everybody should start at the bottom and then build their way up. There's nothing wrong with that. Sometimes when you start at the bottom, you know, you can work your way up fast. But, I mean, if you have that opportunity, you can get that management to pick, um, position, I say go for it. Reporting for Fort Bliss, I'm Army Sergeant Mike Grimm.